Soon you'll be able to enjoy chicken grown inside a lab. Cultivated chicken is now approved to be sold in the United States. But how is it made and how can you get a taste? Let me explain. Two California-based companies, Upside Foods and Good Meat, got the green light to serve up a new kind of chicken. This makes the U.S. only the second country in the world to get the approval to sell lab-grown meat. It's been sold in Singapore since 2020. And just like regular meat from a live animal, cultivated meat begins with cells. Experts take these cells from fertilized eggs or tissue. Companies can also use chicken cells sold commercially. Next, the cells are fed a broth-like mixture filled with all the nutrients they need to grow, like amino acids, sugars, and vitamins. With the help of this special blend, the cells turn into skeletal muscle, fat, and connective tissue. While inside tanks called cultivators, this chicken grows quickly. After days or weeks, it's shaped into nuggets, cutlets, or other products. Advocates of cultivated meat say this kind of food is more sustainable, grown without antibiotics and without the methane emissions from traditional animal agriculture. But don't expect to see it in your next trip to the grocery store. Cultivated chicken will hit restaurants first as companies work on increasing production and lowering the cost. One expert in cell-based food says you can look for it in the poultry aisle in the next seven to 10 years. Globally, more than 150 companies are trying their hand at developing lab-grown meat products. On the menu next, beef, pork, and lamb.